I think a lot of you will be very happy with my tutorial today because I'll be sharing with you guys my secret on how to get a slimmer, sharper and smaller face. I think everybody would love to get a smaller face, right? Unless you're one of those very unfortunate people with like a very long face that's shaped like a moon. <laughs> okay, so let's get started. Uh, basically, it's just a very simple two-step plan. And the first thing I'm going to be applying to my face, yes, applying, uh, is this thing called the Bio Essence Face Lifting Cream. So this is how it looks like, okay? This cream is just amazing. I don't know if you guys have tried it. Apparently, it's quite popular in Singapore and it's not very expensive, maybe like $40 in like Watson's. It's actually a moisturizer, so it looks like this. Uh, the inside is a white color oil based cream so it's actually not that good as a moisturizer because it tends to be a little bit heavy but the amazing thing about this cream is that it actually comes with a measuring tape inside the box that it comes with and this measuring tape is put there right because supposedly after you use the cream you are supposed to lose a few cm around your face and actually I don't know how they measure it lah, but apparently many many people have tried the, the measuring tape thing and it really works so I'm gonna give it a try today to show you guys I have with me the cutest ever tape measurer <laughs> okay I know it doesn't look like a tape measurer but basically this is a Liz Lisa uh, stuff toy and her name is Shampoo and look it's so cute Oh, okay anyway so the funny thing is that there's a tape measure coming out of her ass. So before I apply the cream, I'm going to measure my face from the tip of my mouth to my ear ends about 11, 11 cm under my lips I guess <laughs> from ear to ear okay this is 29 so 11 and 29 so I'm gonna give it a try now put the cream on the only thing I don't like about this product is that it's in a stupid tub form and I've tweeted many times before that I really hate moisturizers that are in tubs. It's such a stupid design. I don't know who came up with it. I think it's a man because he doesn't have nails. So he's like, oh, I'm going to put my disgusting dirty finger inside this thing and dig out cream and put it on my face. <laughs> okay, anyway, so enough with my pet peeve. And I've got a tip for you girls. Basically, if you, like me, hate putting your finger in there, uh, to dig out your moisturizer, you can just use this this scoop thing, right? I will put a huge amount of it on the lid itself. Every time I open, I can just use my fingers to dab some on my face so it's not so dirty and disgusting. So I'm gonna put some on my face now. And basically what I typically do would be to put some around this area. So that's it. Just put like a good amount. Lah. If you don't really like the moisturizer, right, you can always just wash it off after you're done with it slimming your face so basically i think what this moisturizer does is that it actually fixes water retention because after like a few hours i notice my face just becomes fat again but the amazing thing is that it really works for those days where you feel very bloated and you feel like you know you just desperately want to be slim for a few hours for a photo shoot or or a video that you want to record like for example your wedding day or whatever so I just put a good amount. I know I look so stupid rubbing my face like this. Put some around your jawline and especially some under your chin and the neck area. When you put on the moisturizer, it actually gives you this tingling effect. Alright, so I am done with the moisturizer on my face. It's working its magic. Okay, so I'm back uh, after putting on the cream. Actually, it only takes about a few minutes uh, for it to really work. Oh my god, it's 10 cm. It's like amazing. How the hell does this happen? Oh my god! Okay, so it's 10cm here. I'm gonna do the under lip thing now. Okay. Did I say 29 just now? It's 26 now. Oh my god, this cream is freaking amazing. So, that is awesome! I lost a total of about 3cm across my face. Does it appear smaller now? And we're going to go on to the next step now. The next step for me would be to use bronzer to contour your face. What I have with me here is a makeup bronzer from Victoria's Secret and it's called Wow Thing. And the reason why it's my favorite, right, is because it, it comes like this. The top part, right, is more like a shimmer and the bottom 
it's very dark brown so I can use like varying shades wherever I want to get a smaller face it's not only important to have this part like your jaw slim it's also important to put bronzer on this part to make your face entirely slim like that and these two bones called the zygoma or whatever they are called basically your cheekbones if they protrude out a lot you don't want your lower jawline to be very small and have this like a uh, jaw cheekbone thing really protruding out it makes your face look very triangular and according to Pixar right all the villains have triangular faces So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take the shimmer part which is the lighter part of my bronzer and I'm going to put it around my cheekbones here so this is what I do so for this part I'm going to put a streak here that makes it look like I have cheekbones so for that I'm going to use the medium shade somewhere in the middle starting here see where your natural line is you just fill out the hollows of your cheeks so this is one side done and one side not done and you can clearly tell I have the model like look here you know Zoolander and this side is like meh now for the jawline to make it more defined I'm gonna put the dark shade put it along my jawline like this to make my face look like a V shape so this side of the face is clearly smaller now I'm gonna do the other side I love how this also gives me like a healthy glow on my cheeks so I really like it okay you don't want to overdo this otherwise you look like you have a beard next I'm going to complete the look by putting on blusher because blusher should actually be put on after you put bronzer I think so I'm done and I think my face now looks a little bit slimmer I hope <laughs> I'll be putting a side-by-side -side comparison to show you guys so come on okay so this is me side-by-side -side with before bio essence and before bronzer so you can have a look and see whether you think what I thought is effective Okay, hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. Remember to subscribe and just remember if you're nice and you subscribe, you will get a smaller and slimmer face, okay? You cannot just take people's advice like that and go ahead and get prettier and then not subscribe. That's just horrible, okay? So please subscribe. Thank you. Bye!